It is easy to grow a healthy rose plant with beautiful flowers and a healthier growth. But sometimes the rose plant suddenly starts wilting and dying. Therefore in this video, I am going to show you the 5 main reasons why the rose plant is dying. And also some of the solutions that helps you to cure this problem. So let's start. Hit the subscribe button and press the bell icon to get notified. Rose plant may be dying due to any of these 5 reasons that I am going to show you in this video, so wisely identify the problem and make its solution accordingly. Rose plant may shows a stunted growth and dying condition due to number of issues, but these 5 reasons are the most common reasons that cause this problem. So, the number 1 and the most common reason of dying roses is temperature. Rose plant is a winter season plant, and a change of temperature in the environment can cause its stunted growth. In the winter season, as the temperature starts to decrease suddenly, the rose plant became stressed and don't produce new leaves and buds. But it is a natural process, that will be recovered automatically. After a few days, the rose plant adapt the temperature and continue its healthier growth again. So when the rose plant shows dying effects and a stunted growth, don't get panic. Keep some patience, it's due to stress that will be recovered within 1-2 to two weeks. The next most common reason of stunted growth of rose plant is wrong watering. Rose plant requires a well-draining soil to grow healthily, a soil mixture with poor drainage can cause water blockage, that cause root rot problem. The rose plant also shows a stunted growth, and if you don't make any solution then it starts dying. To overcome the overwatering problem, always choose a well-draining, fertile soil mixture for growing roses. You can also buy an ideal soil mix for roses from the description box. The other option must be watering properly, always check the soil moisture before watering your rose plants. Water the rose plant only when the soil is getting a little dry, hope you are getting my points. I have also made an article on the reasons of why the rose plant dying, that you should must read to understand these things more clearly. The link is added in the description box and also on my website puregreena.com. The next main reason of why the rose plant is dying is diseases. Bacterial, fungal, viral attack all of these can cause this problem. There are many diseases in roses. That are caused by number of pests, and insects. If the rose plant is affected by any disease, then it may show some symptoms that you have to identify and treat accordingly. But we are not going in that, simply keep your plant healthy and immune of harmful diseases. For that you can lose the upper soil layer every 10 days, add an organic fertilizer and use an organic pesticide every week. These things boost the immunity of rose plant against many harmful diseases. The next reason of dying roses is wrong fertilization. A stunted growth and dying condition can also be caused by nutritional deficiency and over fertilization. If you are not fertilizing your rose plants regularly, then it may shows a stunted growth and very slow growth. But if you have overly fertilized your rose, then it will starts burning and drying, just like this. It is due to the overuse of fertilizer that cause this problem. Overuse of pesticides can also cause this problem, but this problem mainly occurs when we use chemical fertilizers and pesticides. Chemical-based products have severe effects on the plant and soil health that should be avoided. Always use an organic fertilizers with a proper method of use. For that you can subscribe to my channel and I will help you through my videos. The next reason can be soil pH. Rose plant is a flowering plant that loves to have a slightly acidic soil mixture. An acidic soil mixture enhances the growth of buds and flowers, in the alkaline soil mix the growth of rose plant remains very slow and stunted. To make your rose plant's soil acidic, you can use a teaspoon of apple cider vinegar or a teaspoon of dried tea wastes. Both of them have acidic effects on the soil, that helps your roses to grow constantly. pH of soil depends very much when you are growing roses, for that you must have to include an acidic ingredient in the fertilizer recipe or in the soil mix. This thing helps you a lot to keep your rose plant healthy. So these are the 5 main reasons of why the rose plant is dying. Hope you understand the causes and their simplest solutions. You can also check that article from the description link, and if you wants to boost the growth of your rose plant, then check out this video, and don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching.